change the line height or line spacing of your post or your paragraph in the WordPress, you have two options without plugin. First is using Gutenberg editor. If you are using a modern themes, then so to do that, you need to open your post in the Gutenberg editor just like this. So you need to select the text you want to add line spacing to. So after you selected this, so you have a block settings here and there is a typography settings. So there is a three dots menu here. Just click on it and there is a letter spacing or and there is a line height. So if you click on the line height and you can add a certain amount of line height you want or you want to decrease, you can do that easily with the help of this. So this is only work for the newer themes. But if you don't have themes, don't worry about it. We have a solution for you as well. So for that, you need to add some code. You need to go to the front end of your website with you as signed on as admin and click on the customize. Okay. So after you click on the customize, there is an option of additional CSS. So here you need to input your code. So if you are editing your page, then you need to add a custom CSS like this. Dot page P and there's a line height of this. So 2 E E M or if just test this particular number out if you want more and less you can easily do that with the help of this but if you are going to add for the post you can easily delete dot page with the post so as you can see the line head has been increased so if i add more like four then more line spacing has been added to it so this is a very basic way to do that without any plugin so you don't need to add any plugin on any sort but if you need to add it on page you can just hit this and add this as a page but even though it doesn't work for your post, then there can be a reason that your post does not have these selectors. For example, dot post. And for that, you need to see which selector you have or where your content has been wrapped up. For that, you need to right click on your website. Just click on the inspect. Okay. So this is the content wrap. So if you go, there's a content, right? And this. Is. So the post has already been added to this. So if the class is not added as a post, you can go ahead and see where you need to add your classes. So there is also an article tag. So if you want, if you don't have a post CSS class, then you can delete this and add article. This will also work. So don't worry if you don't, if that specific code doesn't work, you can also type this article. So as I, as we can see, the everything is wrapped up in the article container so if we use this as in as in our css file so click on the publish and it will get published so this is the best way to add without any plugin because see you in the next video